Dear friends, Dr. Madhuri Roy again. So, in continuation with our last video about male fertility, we are going to talk today about age and male fertility. Men often think that their age does not matter when fathering a child and only female's age is important. But dear friends, from a biological standpoint, men can father a child as early as 20 years and as late as 50 years. There is a Guinness World Record where the father was 92 years old at the time of his child's birth. But researchers have shown that and studies have shown that after the age of 40, the men's sperm's quality and quantity both starts declining and that brings many negative impacts on the future child. So what about men's biological clock and when do men stop producing sperm? Practically speaking, men do not stop producing sperm and they can continue producing sperm. But they still have a biological clock with the advanced age or with advancing age, the men's quantity and quality of the sperm damages, mutations happens and these damages the DNA of the sperms, which not only impacts their fertility, but also impacts the future child health. So dear friends, there is a study, studies have shown that the men who father a child after the age of 40 do develop some neurological development in the children and the kids which are born to the males who are 40 and more are at fourfold increased risk of developing autism spectrum disorders. Also, males who are 45 and more and are trying for the pregnancies do increases the risk of miscarriages in their female partner and that is irrespective of the wife's age. So, you might have understood that men's age does matter when it comes to the fertility potential. And what is the best window for having a child? Again, here again, 25 to 30 is the best period when you can father a child. That's how the nature has made us. We should not try for the child after the age of 35 years as it will bring a lot of high-risk pregnancies and future health impacts in the offsprings. Thank you so much.